reacting to pretty late the House of Dragons trailer. Yes. We've been debating um, for a while now whether we wanted to follow the show uh, or not. And it's just for, because we were, if you don't know, we were huge fans. I put him on yes, she did. to Game of Thrones. I literally begged him for two years to watch that in, show. In fact, to give more context, she, not only me, but all of our friends, even her brother, to watch it. And with a long time of, the, of struggling, she convinced us, and now we are fans until season eight. Yeah, so. everyone, everyone was disappointed about <clears throat> season eight. So right, when they right. released the the news that there was going to be a prequel, you know, House of Dragons, we all of us we were like, eh, we're not gonna watch we it. Were you know what I mean? We're like, forget this. They already fucked it up. Yeah. But thanks to all of the trailers, and I've been following this lovely woman mm -hmm. on TikTok. Her name, her at is Cat Lady J. Yes. And she makes these amazing videos about Game of Thrones because she read all the books. She understands the lore mm -hmm. and everything. She, her excitement and everything that she's been posting, as well as the trailers, looking fucking amazing, by the way. And all of the entertainment weekly stuff. I was like, okay, interest peaked once again what i wanted to do was that i saw the trailer but i didn't want to watch it mm -hmm. but i read the comments and i'm seeing a lot of positive positive vibes yeah coming from the comics from the comments of people looking forward to this show exactly and a lot of them are saying that it's making good um references to the book yeah and stuff and they're paying good homage to it so i decided hey babe Let's react to House of Dragons. And here we are. Yes. Um, so FYI, you know, we we saw the we saw the um we saw the show. But um we're just gonna react to it and I don't know what else to say. <laughs> so oh check out Cat Lady J's TikTok. She makes amazing, <laughs> amazing Game of Thrones, Star Wars, and Lord of the Ring content. Yes. You should watch yes. her channel. But don't forget to subscribe like. and leave a comment. And let's go check out this House of Dragon trailer three days too late. Mm -hmm. But we still hope you guys like it. 12 million views. So let's see. Here we go. All right, here we go. Beautiful. Dragons! Matt! Dragons! I love that actor. All right, HBO. Don't disappoint now. The Iron Throne. It looks better. Like, very it's spiky. Kind of my memory. My heart is out. Thunder moves. Spent from shields and ringing swords. And I place my hand upon the Iron Throne. So, look, you got a cut from the throne, too. So, this is not the. This is not the magic Daenerys' father. This is generation magic. Not of that of your succession. Who else would have a claim? The first born mm. child. Rhaenyra. Rhaenyra! Rhaenyra's ever sat the iron front. The king has an heir, Daemon Targaryen. I will not be made to choose between my brother and my daughter. I have been free. When a Targaryen is born, God flips a coin. Oh, look at the dragons! Night will come out. I am promised. Your duty is to make a new wife. I have decided to name a new heir. I'm your heir. Is the force? Yes, it is. Do you think the realm will ever accept me as their queen? No. A woman will uh -huh. not inherit. She looks good, the though. Because that is. No. Wasn't she supposed to inherit it before? Nice graphics! Looks good! The dragon! Yes! Only has dragons. Their power man should never try with it. Oooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooo
see what the comments did justice. The comment section did justice. My heart literally skipped a beat when I saw the dragon's face just like slowly. Yes. Like, like I kind of got scared a little. Yes. I'm actually <sighs> excited a little bit now. Me too. Me too. Me too. I Me too. Hope. Me too. To God. The people who are doing this show, <laughs> please don't fuck this up. Please. <laughs> because if you do, you're going to bring back a lot of Game of Thrones back, fans back. Me, please, because <laughs> uh, when I binge watch from season one to seven, all I talked about was that with Booth, mm -hmm. like every day, mm -hmm. and 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 the way season eight butchered it, like you know, for fuck's sake, John Jon Snow is a half Targaryen for no fucking reason. Oh, by the way, I heard that there's going to be a Jon Snow show. I heard that as well. Say that three times fast. Jon Snow show? Jon Snow show? show, 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 show. <laughs> yeah, I heard that there's going to be, I mean, like, a sequel. I don't think that's needed. Honestly, I wanted them to do the, the Children of the Forest thing mm. instead of Jon Snow show. Jon Snow, Snow show, yes. Yeah. But, hey, we'll get Kit back, so. But yeah, like, they just butchered the whole buildup of him being half Targaryen yeah, and whatever yeah. to nothing. Even Tyrion. I th thought t Tyrion was half Targaryen too, which is why he looks the way he looks. And that's why he got so much hate from his father and his family and la 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 la. Yeah. I was like, yo, they ruined it. But seeing how this, this show looks amazing is performed. Now, I really mm. love, I see that they're setting up, I don't know, I didn't read the books, yes. so I don't know much. But one thing I know is that this was like, I think 300 to 400 years ago before the events of mm -hmm. Game of Thrones. Like, okay. generations So, ago. let's talk about the cast. Matt Smith. I, I need to I'm see a huge faces. fan. I'm a huge fan. I need to I'm see a huge faces. fan of Matt Smith. That's yes. why I was like, the yeah. first thing I saw, I was like, Matt. Yes. That, 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 that sold it for me. That brought me in. Mm -hmm. Whatever um, thoughts I had that I didn't want to continue went out the window. Yeah. Because I love Matt so much. Yes. Now, Renera. It's probably going to be the center of everything, mm -hmm. and I am so happy. I mean, she's probably not going to end up being queen or whatever. I didn't read the books again, yeah, yeah. but you know what I mean? Like, the thought, the political intrigue. I think she's going to have tra drama with that girl with the red hair Yes. that comes in. I think she's going to be the new wife of the king, yes. and the king has to choose between his son. Wait. His son or the true heir, which is probably it's, Renera, you know, it's always as like, his successor. It's always like a bloodline debate with these types of yeah, things, yeah, you know? Yeah. And this guy. Graham. Graham oh, I, love, I love him. I love him so much when it comes to The Hobbit, when it, he was an outlander. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, he's a great actor, and I know he's going to deliver, too. So, yeah, I'm really looking forward to the show. Me and too. I just pray to God it doesn't disappoint. I just know? also love how they did Renera. Like, when she was younger, mm -hmm. she looked so innocent. She looked so nice. Her and the girl seemed like they had a relationship, you know, nice. And then they grew apart. And then mm. you can see the wear and tear on her face. Yes. She's hardened. You know what I mean? Just like, her too. Just like the other Daenerys. girl too. Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. The other girl too, she looks like she's playing the game. They're playing the game. The Game of Thrones is being played. And then again, <laughs> like, you know, when uh, Targaryen is born, the guys flip a coin to see which one is mad or not. And yeah. I, I, I see it. I see it. I see it. I love it. And I love how the Iron Throne looks. Like, it looks good. And I love that they showed that he cut his hands on the Iron Throne. Yes. From what I know from. What I've heard from Cat Lady J, the Iron Throne in the books is meant to be uncomfortable. Yes. And it, I, I guess they can't rebuild it, but from the pictures that we saw from the books, the Iron Throne looks even more impressive. Like, it looks like, why is that even a throne? Uh -huh. yeah, like, it looks so jagged and everything. And they said that um, if you just move like a you slight position, you get cut. So you need to be careful when you're sitting. But lastly, wow. the one thing that I want to talk about are the 
fucking dragons. I don't know their names. Well, I saw multiple. But we have, of course, you yeah. know, that's when they're multiple. all alive. Multiple. That, that red dragon. And then there was a foot of one. It looks like it was massive. massive. Remember in Game of Thrones, there was a dragon, the head of a dragon in the basement? Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe and that was it. That was, it's supposed to be one of the one of the most famous dragons in game of thrones That's and true. the biggest one too but the, by the size of its foot it looks pretty massive I, I was like, maybe that's it you I know i forgot about that yeah, yeah. like they were, uh, i think one of them was trying to burn king's landing right and it was like in the basement remember no 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 it I, just the head of it that was in um and Game of Thrones, and it was supposedly the biggest dragon, and it's red. So, and then we saw, dude, I can't, I can't tell you. Like when I saw the dragon's face at the end of the yeah. trailer, yeah. something happened. Like I it backed like away a little. It was it. like a fear. Yes, it was like my flight or fight response was activated even though i know it's not fake but just the way it yes. came plus the way they did it i was like yeah plus we got a really big tv so, yeah we have a oh, what 60 inch 60 inch yeah 60 inch. so we're seeing it it's, it's huge you guys so like it felt i don't know how to yeah. explain it like my my basically the good it did good oh. and I'm looking forward to it you can so. tell how excited I am again I just don't want to be disappointed and it's my heart a, is fragile it's been a while since I've seen her excited like this for a show so yes. I can't tell you how much I love Game of Thrones yes. it was literally my favorite show we all did of course everybody we but you know did. whatever but I think whew, I want to watch have hope. I want to have hope um, I know they said they're sticking to the books and everything so and George R. R. Martin yes. is involved. Yes. So, it uh, needs to be good. Anyways. Anyways. Guys, this was our reaction to House of Dragons, the official trailer. And please let us know what you thought of the trailer, our input, and comment whatever you think. Because yeah. I'm actually excited and I have hope. Don't forget to subscribe. Like. And leave a comment. We'll see you in the next reaction video. Bye guys. Bye. See you soon.